Ashley and Avril Lavigne. Yeah. They rock, they roll, they got style, and they've got soul. Yeah, whatever she said. Okay, let's take a look at the nominees for Best Female Video. And the winner... Is... Ready? Is... Muchas gracias. Efectivamente, Diego tiene razón. Nos tocó con una linda criaturita anglosajona. Y estamos aquí para presentar el premio al mejor grupo o dúo, damas y caballeros. Pero les vamos a tener que avisar que eh, solamente hay una sola lengua para todo el grupo. Así que... Sí, recomiendo que al final del show la vendan en el mercado negro se repartan lo que saquen, lo que saquen y luego se lo gasten en table dance o en masajes privados que están muy buenos acá en Miami. Really Miami. La lengua... <risa> vale mucho dinero. La lengua vale mucho dinero. <risa> Estos son los nominados. ¿A quién? ¡Qué padre! ¡Woo! Ok, la lengua asquerosa babosa se va a ir directamente en la categoría Mejor Grupo. Go ahead, darling. ¡Lale! ¡Woo! I gotta tell you, we're here to present the award for the best dance video. A great dance video means great music and great style. Something you guys know a thing or two about. You guys set the standard for rock star videos. You guys did Hungry Like the Wolf, Girls on Film. <laughs> you had exotic locations and foxy ladies, hot clothes. Hot. But you know what, what? You guys never won a VMA. Uh, That's right. Oh, no. That's not right, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, but you know what? The VMAs didn't even exist when we started making videos. You guys invented girls on film. There you go. Come on, people, let's check this out. <laughs> yeah. And the winner is... Justin Timberlake. Well, this is also about giving away hardware to people putting out records. Would you do the honors? For the first nominees. Yeah, and the nominees for Much Loud Best Rock Video are... Here, director Scott Winnick. Well, now that's pretty close, Avril. Please, let us know. And the winner for Much Loud Best Rock Video goes to... My guy, Billy Talent! Billy Talent! Awesome! Amazing! For their voices in the upcoming movie Over the Hedge, Bruce Willis and Abra Levine! We are here to present you so one so of the favorite movie actors! Alright, so Bruce, this is your first time at the Kids' Choice Awards. I'm gonna have to give you a few tips. But that, that's not necessary, Avril, not necessary, okay? How old are you? I'm, I'm old. I'm, I'm really old. The winner's name is in the box. The winner's name is in the box? And the winner is... The 
Hughes Van Gogh and Chainsaw Awards. Featuring Jonathan Davis. Welcome, Punk Princess, Avril Lavigne, and Corn Frontman, and star of Sinjin Smith, Jonathan Davis. What's up? All right. Fans often create videos that reflect memorable images, seared onto our brains by horror movies. But the winning band tonight decided to use one of the scariest films of all time as their inspiration, The Shining. Here to perform their song, The Kill, and the winner, a video inspired by film. Give it up for 30 seconds to Mars. Just need to stay at the other scene. Под ваши аплодисменты. Аврил Лавин. Я переведу. Привет, Москва. Hello. MTV Russia. I am bad translator. Yeah. Okay. Very bad translator. It's me. Паша okay. Фуфлу. Yeah. Well, I'm uh, here tonight to present the award for the best rock project. Она поздоровалась. And the winner. И говорит самый лучший. Let's see. B2. А вот так заслуженные австралийцы получают... Ustedes elegen a los ganadores. Nosotros elegimos en México. I thought that was perfect. Amigos, amigos. Es el video del año. Okay, this is your award. This is an award that you all voted for. And in that spirit, I think you should be the ones to give it away. So I'd like to invite some of you to come up on stage. Everybody's invited to come up right now if you can. Come on, come on up. Come on up. Come on. There we go. All right. I think we're ready here now. So this is the biggest award tonight. For pants on, please welcome Ava Levine. How are you? Good to see you. How are you? Good. How are you? Now, you just dropped your third album, Best Damn Thing Ever. So, what's the best damn thing in your life right now? I'd have to say the best damn thing is being at the Much Music Awards right here tonight. All right. Here are the nominees for the Much More Music Awards. <laughs> okay, Avril, let us have it. Okay, and the winner is Nickelback. 
to see ya. Good to see ya. Yeah, you too, Ivan. Albert wanted to give it to you guys, so I let her hand it over. Anything you want to say to the fans, all the viewers at home? Oh. The dictionary defines alternative as unconventionally non-traditional. Do you know what that means? Well, I'd say that the artists up for this next award are simply amazeballs. And the American Music Award goes to Muse. Cool, thanks very much. Hello, everybody. And the nominees tonight are... Um, and the winner is... It's exciting, isn't it? Bum, ba -da bum Ooh. I could be his dad or his mum, Justin Bieber. <laughs> um, and fellow Canadian right here. Thank you so much, everybody. Last year, he won a Teen Choice Award for his self-titled R&B album, and he's nominated for two more awards tonight. Make some noise for Jason Derulo! <laughs> and these are the finalists for the top digital song and the Billboard Music Award goes to... Carly Rae Jepsen! U.S. Billboard Chart debut. Here is Avril Lavigne. This next performer is a musical prodigy who meant his mentor when he messaged Skrillex on MySpace. He went on to make remixes for the biggest stars in the world, including the Black Eyed Peas, Lady Gaga. And now his live shows have blown up, and tonight we've got him right here. Las Vegas, here is Zed. Hey guys. This year, we, we were introduced to a new artist whose debut album marked a major return for rock and roll on the charts, from Driver's License to Good For You to Deja Vu. Olivia's singles from her album Sour have been a part of the collective psyche of 2021, and she wrote every single one of them. Her songs are personal, her songs are raw, and her songs are relatable. Please welcome to the stage Variety's Songwriter of the Year, Olivia Rodrigo. Music gives us the power to feel, to heal, and to connect. Here are the nominees for Video for Good. And the VMA goes to my girl, Billie Eilish, your power! Thank you, Avril. I love you so much. Um, I know this is fan voted, so you guys are all I owe to. I love you so much. I love you. I love that I get to hand out the award for best new artist tonight because it's about to change somebody's life like it changed mine 20 years ago. You've been all voting all night. So let's take one more look at the nominees. And the VMA goes to Dove Cameron. As someone who released their first album at 17, I completely understand 
what iHeartRadio's 2022's Female Artist of the Year has been through in this past year. It's terrifying, it's exciting, and it comes at you super fast. All in the face of this, all of this, Olivia Rodrigo hasn't even flinched. <laughs> Which is not surprising because you can see her strength in her music and you're grabbed by her captivity voice, captivating voice and soul-wrenching lyrics. Her authenticity shines and you remember what it feels like to be 18 all over again. It's been a thrill to watch everything she's done so far, but what's even more exciting is that I know that she's only just getting started. <laughs> so let's take a look at your Our Heart Radio Female Artist of the Year, Olivia Rodrigo. I'm obsessed with you, you're amazing. Thank you for being here. Amazing, amazing. Congratulations. Thank you. Ooh. It's good to be home at the Chunos. All right, I got two, perf uh, two uh, la, la, la. it's the Fan Choice Award. And um, this award, in my opinion, is the best award because it's voted for by you guys. And that's what matters, that's what counts the most. Not a committee, not the jury. And I've been lucky enough to win this award a couple times. <laughs> Thank you. All right, well tonight the nominees are all right, and the TikTok Gino fan choice goes to Sean Mendez. Thank you. And now a Grammy Award that's all about what we can do when we put our voices together, like so many great artists are doing tonight. These are the nominees for Best Pop Duo Group Performance. And the Grammy goes to... Kiss Me More, Doja Cat, featuring Susan. It is my pleasure to present the ACM Poets Award to Shania Twain. Avril, you are just plain old kick ass. You should have gone into country music, honestly. I always remember my first Junos 20 years ago, and so much has changed since then, but one thing that will never change is how incredible of an experience it is to perform in front of Junos fans. <laughs> I'm introducing an artist who's blown up on the global music scene with a new wave of R&B, hip hop, and pop records fused with his Punjabi roots. Based in Victoria, BC, his music has gained a worldwide audience with sold out shows in Canada, the US. Get the fuck off. <laughs> Get the fuck off, bitch. <laughs> he has sold out shows in Canada, the US, the UK, the UE, and India. And this is his moment. <laughs> Coming to the stage next, 
the first ever Punjabi act to perform at the Junos history. Global phenom, AP Dylan. Yeah.